Bismillah, Alhamdulillah, Salatu Wassalam Ala Rasulillah. Try to never ever point your finger at your mom and dad. That's really bad. Like bad deeds that shaitan wants you to do, just say Audu Billahi when a shaitan jeep and you'll just go away. Always try to listen to your mom and dad. Whenever you listen to them, Allah becomes happy. Every time you do a really bad sin, the, just remember the left shoulder angel going to write that down. We don't want that to happen. In the day of judgment, Allah is going to see how many good deeds we did and how many bad deeds we did. And if we did so many good deeds then, and less bad deeds, then we go to Jannah. So anytime when you try to do a mistake, try to do istighfar right away and try to ask Allah's forgiveness. A strong Muslim is, controls his anger and always makes sure he does good things. So as good Muslims, we want to do the same. We have to know that we have to do less bad deeds and more good deeds so that it reaches the level of people because you know some people they might be doing bad stuff and when they see you doing lots of good deeds they might become doing all this good stuff and you do want this to, that to happen and this to happen and this is what I wanted to say so Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Bismillah, alhamdulillah, salatu wa salam ala rasulillah. So the next topic I wanted to say about being patient. So, we always try to be patient like the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. <coughs> Being patient is like waiting. Whenever our mom and dad tries to say that we can't do it now, like, you know, you want something to eat, you want... When they say, I can't do it right now, what, what we have to do, we have to be patient. Like, for example, this was a story of a woman who was patient and she went to paradise because of this. That her clothes used to come off. How she became patient is she went to the Prophet Muhammad She said, Prophet Muhammad can you please, you know, make dua for me to, um, to Allah to make my uh, fever go away? And then he said, do you either want me to make dua for you, or to Allah to, or, you know, or make to make you feel well from your fever, or do you want to be patient? She said, I want to be patient, but just please make dua to Allah to make my clothes not come off. So he made dua to Allah for his, her clothes not to come off, and because of her patient, Allah gave her Jannah to Fadus because of all her patience. So we always try to be patient. For example, when there's something so long to do, try to, that, that our mom and dad it, it can't do it yet, then have to be patient. So that's all I wanted to say. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.